Good morning, afternoon, or evening, whatever it is your time zone across the world. It is Motivational Wisdom Time. Today, I'm going to educate you so you can grow and lead. A fundamental principle I use in my management consultant services. We're going to start off with a scripture as I always do. In Philemon chapter 1 verse 14. But without thou mind would I do nothing. That thou benefit should not be as it were of necessity but willingly. Today we're going to examine the word benefit and how it relates to the practical and biblical principles for spiritual growth. In essence, benefit represents the positive value of comparison between two situations. In corporations, it's called a competitive advantage, a distinction to make improvement to profit for the greater, and to benefit by positive change. In chatting with my daughter, Sabrina, we had a productive conversation by texting about college. The word beneficial came up as advice from her academic counselor in college. Beneficial stuck with me because it derives from benefit, which gives you a choice to choose between two situations. One will bring progress and the other will delay the expected outcome. Think of it this way. When accepting employment for a position, a benefit package is offered. You have to choose voluntarily the best package to fit your needs or compensation. How will this meet my necessity? It is your consent of free will. What lessons can be learned about benefit? There are seven important lessons about benefit. Discovering the truth and questions of how. Lessons learned about benefit. One, how will this benefit me to add positive value? Two, how will this benefit promote prosperity and personal happiness to add value or worth? Three, how will this benefit add a competitive advantage in short and long-term goals? Four, how will this benefit promote good health or well-being? Five, how will this benefit open new doors of opportunity to advance? Six, how will this benefit make an impact for the greater in life? Seven, how will the advice about the benefit Help guide me. In closing, there are times a good productive conversation will help you refocus on the right benefit. Choose the best benefit that will add value, good health, well-being, and prosperity. Consult God for wisdom in making choices. Only connect with people that has your best interest in mind. Guess what? This is an open book test. Remember, the benefit is only beneficial if it brings added value to an expected outcome. Choose wisely and avoid delays to your progress. You have value. This is Lady Cynthia Kelly signing out with Motivational Wisdom. Stay tuned for next week. Be blessed and stay connected to Jesus.